ABC's General Hospital Sports revealed that Trina will have a heated argument between Curtis and Portia. Ever since Trina and Roy started dating, she often goes out. Trina's no longer a docile, obedient girl like before. Previously, Portia also objected to Trina dating Roy, but her daughter didn't listen. Although a lot of people say Roy's good, Portia still feels that something is wrong and doesn't want Trina to be in such a hurry. Now, after the killer is very rampant in Port Charles, everyone's extremely worried about their own safety, as well as their families. So when he saw Trina often going out of the house these days, Curtis resolutely prevented him. He always had a bad premonition, and he was worried that Trina would be attacked. Trina refused to listen and blamed Curtis for taking too much care of her. But Portia also agrees with Curtis that it's best to stay at home, which makes Trina extremely angry when her mother also supports Curtis. But will Trina listen to the two of them, or will she continue to secretly go out and date Rory? Is Trina in any danger, and what will happen? Meanwhile, Carly is still in Jacksonville to continue her business trip if the deal with the incident at the cemetery. Drew at first heard that Carly was in danger and immediately ran to him, and now he is here with her. This is a great opportunity for Drew to confess to Carly, but he's still hesitant and has not yet expressed his feelings. Carly couldn't deal with the cemetery alone, and so she asked Bobby to come help her. She actually went to Jacksonville to help her daughter. Bobby understands the love Carly has for her adopted mother and will do her best to help. Bobby's very happy to see Drew here. She's very supportive of her daughter and Drew getting together, so Bobby will continue to encourage Drew to pursue Carly. With Bobby's encouragement this time, will Drew bravely confess her feelings? When did the two of them start dating? Will the cemetery thing successfully protest? Besides, up to now, Cody's biological father has not been found. Currently, there's a lot of information that Mac is Cody's biological father. So Mac decided to clear this up once and for all. So he reached out to Cody, and Mac wanted to take a DNA test of Cody, but Cody refused. Cody didn't feel friendly in Mac. He just felt that Mac did it out of responsibility and wanted to tell everyone the truth. Moreover, Mac was also hurt and has hurt Cody a lot with his words in the past. If this makes Cody really hate Mac, and even if he really is his father, Cody doesn't want to accept it. Now, Cody's no longer so excited and determined to find his biological father. He just wants to live his own life. Is Cody biological father Mac? What will the truth be and how will things turn out?